Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I would like to share my thoughts on a bad brand, Massachusetts. I believe that's how you pronounce it, but correct me if I'm wrong. So I've been eyeing for this brand for a little bit while. Let me talk a little bit more about the brand. The bag is made in Italy and the brand is also an Italian brand. I discovered this brand from a Facebook group. I think someone mentioned about this brand. And if you look at Purse Forum, there are lots of good reviews and code followers for this brand. There's so many selection of the style, leather, color, and customization options on the website. So at first, it may seem very overwhelming. And indeed, I actually purchased this uh, from the Facebook group, not directly from the website. Because as I mentioned, it could be quite overwhelming as a new customer to choose between so many different styles, colors, letters, and customization options. So I decided to go with a uh, um, secondhand purchase and just to feel if I like the style, if I like the leather, if I like the quality. And the price point of this uh, brand is, I would say it's mid-range price. Um, it could range from like 300 euros to six or 700 euros, depending on the style and depending on the exchange rate where you are at. So it could get quite pricey if you add a lot of customization, choose the premium letter, all that. And the one I picked up is called Verona leather. It is cowhide uh, leather. It has great texture. It is pebbled. Let me try to... It definitely feels like a more um, rough type of leather that will be super durable. And the style is called Hera Midi. So it is a shoulder bag. The color is navy blue depending on the lighting. Today is um, a cloudy day and I'm filming indoor. So the lighting makes it look much more navy. But in direct sunlight or bright lighting, it, the color will look slightly lighter. It's a simple design. Um, just has one shoulder strap. You can add a crossbody strap if you would like. I don't believe this leather is still available. I think that's one thing I noticed about uh, this brand is everything is handmade, made to order. So the the time to wait for getting the, your bag could be long. I think right now it's like four or five months. The lead. So if you place order right now, you can probably get it four or five months later. And the leather sells out. They don't always restock, depends on the type of leather. So it would be very hard for you to purchase a bag if you see someone else get it. The leather may be out of stock. But when I touch the leather, when I touch the bag, the quality I would say is really impressive. This leather feels nicer than my Gucci Soho Disco bag, the type of leather. And the inside is actually lambskin lined. It has a button snap closure, but you can upgrade to zipper closure if you want. It comes with a dust bag, so it has all the elements of a luxury handbag, except not the typical luxury handbag price tag. When I first uh, thought of, think about lambskin, I was a little bit worried it would get scratched easily. However, when I touch this um, interior, it feels luxurious. However, it still feels durable, so I don't think I would have issue with the leather scratch up easily. And I think a leather interior is actually more easy to take care of. You can wipe with warm water if it's dirty or if you need, just need to clean up something quickly. Versus a fabric, if it's a stain, it may be really hard to get out of. So this one I have do not have any outside pocket or custom or this type of customization, but I think you can add pocket if you want. And because I purchased secondhand, I definitely pay attention to the details like the corner where it typically shows wear first. And you can see 
this bag is in absolute perfect condition. No corner wear whatsoever. And that really speaks to the quality of the leather. Typically leather bags show wear at the corner first and also the handle. And you can see the glazing is in perfect condition. So I'm pretty impressive with the quality of the brand, the quality of the leather and the hardware. It's very sturdy, high quality hardware. However, I'm not sure if the style would work for me. The main reason is the bag is a little bit smaller than I expected. I tried to fit my laptop, the 14 inches laptop I always carry, and it doesn't fit. Like it doesn't fit horizontally and it, it will stick out vertically. Let me show you how it looks on me as a shoulder bag. So it looks really good as a work bag if you don't need to carry a laptop. And the other issue I have with shoulder bag is the shoulder slip. You can see this happens to me all the time. I just my shoulder just nothing stays on my shoulder period so even though i really like the bag i'm actually selling it i've had it the same last november or october i think november so i have had it for almost half a year now and i only used it once and when i use it i know immediately noticed this shoulder slip problem but if you are thinking about the brand, I do think the brand quality is amazing and the price point is fair. And if you want to looking for a better deal to try out the style making, before making a big commitment, you can always try to find the Facebook group. It's just the name of the brand. And you can try out um, style from the buy sell trade forums instead of make huge commitment. But hope you find this video helpful. If you are thinking about buying this brand or let me know if you have already purchased from this brand, which is your favorite style. And thanks for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.